Who to? I'll tell you what I've just heard. Well, stand by me. Listen, eh? Keep it under your hat. Don't say I've said. But Ginger Barry is suing somebody again. Yes, he is. He's suing somebody. I think he's suing Nelson Mandela or something, isn't he? Something like that. Anyway, he's taken himself up to New York and apparently, well, obviously, he can't go out without the muchness because, well, she's got him handcuffed to her belt, hasn't she? Shh, shh, don't say I said. Yeah, so he's taking the muchness and he's going to New York and he's going to make a expounding on something or other speech to do with your Nelson Mandela. So, uh, you know, Nelson Mandela he invented that thing, didn't he? Do you remember he invented that no, Mandela effect? Him. Yeah, so anyway, he's taking the muchness and they're taking themselves off to New York and he's going to get himself up on a stage and he's going to give a speech, he is. Yes, he is. And he's going to get an award for being an humanitarian and for being the diversity or divisive or something or other. I don't know what it is anyway. So he's not happy unless he's getting an award and giving a speech, is he really? So anyway, yeah, he's getting himself up to see Nelson Mandela and give a speech all about the Mandela effect and about how he's got to be humanitarian and the green thingy and the climate and some spiel or whatever bullshit that they come out with. Yeah, and on top of that, he's suing the papers again and he's suing the government and I think he's suing a photographer or he's suing somebody called Sue. I don't know what's going on. Honestly, I can't turn my back for a minute, can I do two furs? And they're bleeding off, aren't they? They're like bloody greyhounds, they are. Straight out of the traps, aren't they? Running towards the bleeding rabbits, they are, aren't they? They can't bloody keep themselves themselves for a week, can they, voodoo fooers? No, they bloody well can't. And I'll tell you another thing that's pissed me off as well. I'll tell you exactly what's pissed me off. Because apparently the government, well, say the government, I mean, the government's funded by the taxpayer. So let's just say the taxpayer had to pay a bill for a vegan bleeding paint. Yes, yes, the muchness. Yeah, she, she's a vegan. Yeah, and because she's a real virtuous person, I mean, obviously she's very virtuous. I mean, I should really cross myself every time I mention her name, really, shouldn't I, Vutu? Because she wouldn't have your normal paint, like from your B&Q, or like if you're in America, I think it might be called Target or whatever. No, 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 no. She don't want normal paint. No, it's got to be vegan paint. And it cost about £200,000 or something, this here vegan paint, that they splashed it all over the gaff when they had that Nottingham College up at your Frogmore House, up at your Windsor Great Park, or I don't know where it was, Kensington Palace or somewhere, I don't know where it was. Could have been on the bloody moon for all I know. Anyway, so back to the vegan paint, yeah? So they presented the bill to your government, and your government paid it, and as I say, the government, well, the government just robs us all the time, so yeah. So, a bit like you carry Antoinette, she's the same. Yes, she weren't happy with the blimmin' flat up in your Downing Street and up in your checkers. No, she had to have a £20,000 blimmin' hostess trolley. I'm not being funny, you could get a prostitute for 50 quid, couldn't you? Let alone a hostess trolley. So anyway, uh, where was I? Yeah, back to the vegan paint. So yes, the muchness. Oh yeah, she didn't want ordinary paint. No, 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 she needed vegan paint because... You know the much this she's veganary. Yeah, she's a veganarian. She's a very virtuous person. I mean, if you remember, you remember that little German chap with him with the little Charlie Chaplin moustache he used to get himself about the place in the forties over in your Germany. And he, I think he caused a bit of a rumpus one way and another. Do you remember him? Yeah, him well, he was a veganarian at all. Yes he was, he was a veganarian. Yes, and he was all for your animal rights. Yes. Yeah, so I'll just leave that there. Anyway, so back to the muchness. She's a veganarian and she wanted to have vegan bleeding paint. Yes, she did. Because apparently, well, she keeps vegan chickens. Yes, she does because she feeds them vegetables. And apparently, if you feed chickens vegetables, well, you can eat them, can't you? Because they're vegan, aren't they? It's vegan chicken. So, so there you go. She has a vegan roast chicken and she likes the vegan paint on her bleeding old walls. Well... Unless that's what they call sniff nowadays. I mean, is it a bit of that maybe? And she just wrote it off as vegan paint? I mean, I don't know. It's hard to tell with her, isn't it, eh? So, anyway, I can't wait for the next hallucination that comes across from the ginger berry and your muchness and muchness. And he's going to get himself about a place and he's going to give a little talk about your Nelson Mandela and about the Mandela effect. And, well, we need to be the allies, don't we? 
I mean, I haven't heard for Ginger Barry for about, well, 10 minutes, really, on my tablets. So, yeah, well, I'll be back. I'll be back as soon as I, I know more of you two viewers. I'll keep you posted on it all because, it well, it's all revving up now, isn't it, really? Hey, hey, they've got your sunshine craps. They've got your Christopher pissed up, boozed up and everything. And apparently, no matter how they try, people can still see that the Emperor's bleeding naked. Yeah! So, rather than the Emperor go and pop on some bleeding clothes, no, 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 we're not going to do that, says Ginger Barry. No, we're going to get some more people in. We're going to pay them to basically keep bullying people all across the global world, all across every social media platform, all across every news outlet, all, well, even in your own private house, they're going to pay people to bully us until we absolutely just clap and say, yes, yes, even though you're naked, we really love all your clothes. Yeah, really nice clothes made to gold. Yes, yeah, that's what they're going to do. Yeah, no, they can fuck right off because I'm not, because I'm just going to stand there and say bollocks. That's what I'm going to say, Voodoo Booze. Anyway, bye, see you later, Voodoo. Bye.